Well, good afternoon and welcome to the Idahoan Show. Today I've got an unboxing video for you, sort of. I'm really not big on unboxing videos, uh, but lately I've been working on the packaging design for the standard pattern muzzle loaders that Atomic Rifling and Creative Operations is uh, hoping to be shipping soon. Uh, so, this box uh, represents my prototype packaging design, uh, and today I want to simulate a cross-country uh, shipping uh, endeavor, uh, and then unbox it and see how it fared. Uh, so, to simulate cross-country shipping, uh, you know, I'll basically toss the thing into my truck, uh, toss it back out, uh, I've got another box that I just put a bunch of dirt in that we can toss in on top of it. Uh, so between that, we should be able to simulate, uh, you know, transfer between trucks or between packing stations and, you know, stuff getting piled on top of it. And, of course, we know that postal workers and uh, other shipping personnel are not necessarily always as careful with packages as we would sometimes like them to be. Uh, so, we'll try to simulate sort of a, a worst-case scenario here, and we'll see how the contents of this box actually fares. Okay, so at this point the exterior of the box does look a little scuffed up, much like a lot of packages that I've received over the years. So now let's open this up and see how the contents fared. Okay, so we got some biodegradable packing materials here. Then we've got our muzzle loader wrapped up in some packaging. Well, I'm going to say this looks about as good as it did when I put it in the box. Uh, this was a prototype that we'd done some other testing on before. Uh, so, you know, the powder smudging on the stock and so forth was there before. That didn't come from the packaging. Uh, if there's any new or additional blemishes uh, from the packaging test, uh, they're definitely not noticeable. So. I'm going to call this a successful packaging design. Uh, anyway, until next time, thank you for watching The Idahoan Show.